Hey guys, what's up? Stingray Minecraft Man, and welcome to another video. So, this video is going to be another mod video, and it's going to be on... Uh, I don't have enough room to do this. Man, I need a new oh. video setup. But, this is on my... Man, my minimized heartbreaker bow. So, um, let's get detailed. So, uh, <clears throat> here, I'll pick it up and I'll show you. Um, so what I did here is I took off the bow arms on it. So, here are the bow arms. There's this one, which is, I think, the top one and then the bottom one. So... It used to be like, these would used to go on here or something. And then I also took off the plates. Um, yeah, so, <clears throat> it kind of looks like if you put this back together, like, it could be some sort of, like, melee weapon or something. I don't know. But we're here to talk about this. So, let me set back down here and... Let's talk about this. So, let's um, let's start off with the barrel. It's just the normal barrel, but I took off this piece because it kind of I didn't really think it looked that great, like on there, and I thought this kind of looked like a bit cooler. So, um, the barrel you just um, hang on, let me grab a dart. <clears throat> you just you just um, take a dart and you front load then you pull back until the green piece is sticking out of the back and then you let go and it'll fire so um, that's how the heartbreaker bow works um, this whole mod was just specifically making the heartbreaker bow um, smaller so uh, let's talk about the because I, well, I wanted to make it a lot more compact, because, well, uh, I'm going to be, I'm probably going to be using this for um, my uh, my HVZ party, um, my birthday party, which is coming up soon, um, so uh, it's, it's supposed to be a really practical blaster, even though it doesn't shoot as far as, like, a full modded blaster would. It's still okay. So let's talk about the grip here. Um, the bottom of the grip here used to have a bow arm coming out, and it's much. Uh, it's very comfortable. Like I love the grip on the Heartbreaker bow, and it's very comfortable to hold on. And um, if you <clears throat> if you pull this back for a long period of time, you'll kind of feel like this front part right here is going to tear off, but it's definitely not. Like, if you're pulling this back all the way for a long time, it kind of feels like that's going to happen. Um, but it's not. And then the the sights here, let's talk about these. These actually were, like, kind of mounts for the bow arms, but I can't really... Well, I guess I could. So, they kind of meant to be, like, sights, kind of, but not really well they can be used as sights but they look cool on it like it's a pretty cool looking blaster and then um <clears throat> it's still got that tactical rail so um if you want to add like an ammo holder or something then you can do that and then um let's see uh oh i want to talk about how i got the bow arms off so um, they, let me see here, they, so, the, the string here used to be kind of attached to, um, to in here, in the grip, like, in here, they, these strings used to be attached in there, but what I did is I just pulled out the strings as hard as I could and then cut them with scissors on both sides, and now you used to only be able to fire like this, but now you can fire like sideways too in case you like to do that. 
and this handle can just spin freely because there's like a gearbox here like right around here there's a gearbox which kind of makes like it you it kind of like springs back once you let go of it it actually the bow arms did nothing with this it still has the exact same performance in a much smaller package so uh, i just took like uh this is all the extra bulk that i took off of this and that's very small and compact i love this and even better is you can put it um so there's a Nerf, I have a Nerf bandolier here, uh, ugh, <clears throat> I can't talk. I have a Nerf bandolier here, and, um, my bandolier kind of broke here, but that's easily fixable with hot glue. So, uh, as you can see, this kind of, this is like a magazine port here, so you can store magazines. Um, you can easily slide this in there and then it's like it can fit in there and uh if here I'll put it on and then I'll just flip it around as you can see it's like it can easily fit onto that kind of the magazine like kind of like buckle here and it doesn't slip out because it's got the big handle um so that keeps it from falling out and then sometimes if i keep pistols in here they'll kind of slide out this way but the kind of sights uh will block it from doing that and it's very lightweight and small so i think that's going to be my um my HVZ secondary, well, maybe not secondary, maybe backup shot, but maybe secondary, if I can get an ammo holder up here, focus camera, my camera doesn't want to focus today, but if I can get an ammo holder up here, then that'll be awesome, um, basically, that's my, um, that's my review, or kind of showcase on my modified, uh, minimized heartbreaker bow, um, goodbye.